Hello everybody and welcome back to another reaction video from Out On That Line. And today we're going back to Australia. I will be reacting to the song Stone Cold by Jimmy Barnes and Joe Bonamassa. It's been a minute since we checked in with one of our Australian artists and I am a big Jimmy Barnes guy when it comes to that. I was pretty floored by him in the uh, rest of the songs that I've covered by him. So I'm excited to see what this one is like. And without further ado, let's get into Stone Cold by Jimmy Barnes with Joe Bonamassa.
So right off the top, this is my kind of music. I adore R&B, soul, blues. It's all deadly. And this was perfectly done. Absolutely perfect. Don't change a single stem. Don't you dare. It's absolutely perfect. So like I said, while I was watching it, I love fly on the wall stuff. I fully committed to watching all of Get Back and watching the Beatles in the studio. I love that. I've seen some great Elvis Costello fly on the wall, Lexington Lab. Just watching the musicians playing live is such a special thing because not only are they totally locked in, but they're also having fun because they know they've got it. They're concentrating hard, but at the same time, they're just feeling it move through them. And you can tell that the spirit is strong in Joe Bonamassa. That with some absolutely stone cold killer guitar playing. The solo, hell of a solo. Like I said, absolutely beautiful. And then there's the man himself, Barnsey, Jimmy Barnes. I just, I mean, talk about a guy you can emulate. I, myself, you know, despite being trained in opera, find that the place I'm the most comfortable is in this style of music and I listen to someone like Jimmy Barnes and I just want to be him I understand that he was a wicked party animal and uh you know like to suck down on some of grandpa's cough medicine back in the day I'm a teetotaler we could not be more different Barnsey is completely in touch with his instrument and there's such a, a color to his voice and it's so layered because like on the bottom, you have this really kind of sweet, smoky, caramel type sound. Then you add these kind of more harsh, gravelly elements to it. It never stops being beautiful. It never stops being powerful when he goes from swinging for the fences right down to like Sato and Sweet. The guy is like, crazy Ooh, and one of the things i love is when a group is like so in sync when the ensemble is so locked in because those stops where they go not a single solitary individual was out of time there not an errant squeak not a little too late not a little too early it was absolutely perfect this is as a steely dan guy steely dan levels of studio perfectionism beautifully done absolutely flawless loved it loved it loved it so go ahead i know you're chomping at the bit to get into the comments and tell me what you thought so go ahead and do it and make sure that you continue to tell us the things you want us to react to on this channel got a going list but you can always add more and we'll get to them eventually and until next time thanks for watching uh -huh.